Greece has become the first developed economy to default on a loan from the International Monetary Fund. With Greece and its international creditors unable to agree on a deal, the European Central Bank has frozen funding to Greek banks. This has forced Greece to close its banks to keep them from collapsing. Although Greece has defaulted on an IMF loan payment, this doesn't necessarily mean Greece will leave the Eurozone or the European Union. The Greek government has called a snap referendum for July 5th on further austerity measures demanded by its creditors. If the Greek public says no, the possibility that the country will exit the Eurozone might increase. However, many Greeks might prefer to live with austerity measures than go back to trauma. With the future looking bleak for Greece, Europe's ability to exist as a union is being questioned more than ever. The future of Greece and Europe remains in question. The Greek debt crisis first emerged in 2008 during the outbreak of the global financial crisis, which shook both the US and Europe. In 2009, Greece officially announced its budget deficit exceeded 12% of its gross domestic product. A looming default hovered over Greece. In order to prevent such a crisis, the International Monetary Fund and the European Union stepped in and agreed to lend Greece 110 billion euros in loans over three years. In exchange, former Prime Minister George Papandreou agreed to toughen austerity measures, including budget cuts and tax hikes. A second package with 130 billion euros was also released, but had frozen after the Greek government refused to implement austerity measures. In snap elections early this year, left-wing anti austerity party Syriza led by current Prime Minister Alexis Tsipras came to power. He quickly pushed for changes to the conditions of the existing bailout package. No deal was agreed and both parties extended the bailout package until June 30th. The main area of this agreement is pension reform. Greece and its creditors are also unable to agree on changes to VAT and labor market reform. Currently, a number of analysts have said that Greece may withdraw from the Eurozone following a default in order for the country to deal with its increasingly unmanageable public debt. A Grexit would have an immediate impact on Greece. The Greece banks would face a wave of capital outflows, Euro-denominated debt will be more difficult to repay, and the country's new currency would have very little value. It is estimated that the EU would lose around 236 billion euros if Greece defaults on all its debts. Bigger European economies holding large amounts of Greek debt such as Germany and France would be affected at most by such a default. On the other hand, some economists believe an exit from the Eurozone would help Greece stabilize its economy over the long term. But if Greece would become a success story, it would set an example to other troubled economies in the Eurozone.